Hello friend, welcome back. Recently we introduced Selectors healing feature in Selectors of Pro. So yes, of course, like what, uh, the question is, what is this new feature and how it can help you in your day-to-day -day life and in uh, when you are writing or maintaining the automation script. So Selectors healing feature, it will help you to verify all the selectors, not just X path of your script, of your UI automation script, of course. So wherever you have written the selectors like X path, CSS selector, ID, name, and a lot more, playwright selector, etc. So those selectors are written in a page. Now, if UI got changed, you have to today verify them one by one manually. With this feature, what you can do, you just copy your complete script, look complete locator page, paste it in selectors up and get the result. You will not have to waste even a single second of your time to see whenever there is a UI change, what, which all locators got changed, which all selectors got changed. You just paste your whole script and you get the result. So this is really incredible and very simple to use. Let me quickly show you how to use this feature and I have already created a detailed tutorial. So we'll add the link for that. So now let me show you. So this feature is right now available in Selector Sub Pro. So click on inspect, here you go. Selector Healing, click on this. And suppose you have a very simple script. I will show you example with very simple script. Like, let's say we have this. <coughs> driver dot find element something like this so you copy this complete page come here of course like go to that page on which you wanted to verify those selectors or those selectors are or whichever page they belong go to that page let me show you from beginning open selectors up pro click on this selectors healing feature here button it will open this pop-up here you paste your complete script by default this format will be set here and now you click on submit you see it is giving you the result so this way you would you will be able to verify all your selectors here on uh, selectors of pro now if anything is there like which you want to verify or uh, like okay so these selectors were basically like here i have verified on home page but these all selectors like user id email and all these things are showing zero zero because they are belong they belong to practice page so if we go to practice page and verify these selectors over there which is the right place then it will show you us show the right count like all the counts here so click on this edit button here paste and submit and now you here you will get the count similarly like if you have any other format like let's say you have at find by or anything so all the formats are already there in selectors of pro so you just copy this come here edit and paste now this format is different here it is add find by so you select this add find by from here and submit if anything else is there like let's say you are working with cypress so you copy this and paste it here and this is cypress command so you can select this cy.selector now there will be question like what if you are not using your command is not here in the drop downs in these drop downs okay so in that case how you can set your command what you have to do let's say this is your format so wherever you have written selectors or let me just first give you example with this one driver.find element so let's copy this, paste it here, wherever you have written your selector name, like this is selector name X path or ID or class name. So that you replace with selector and wherever you have written value, so that you return, replace with value keyword. This is very simple and you just set this. This is already there. All of them are there. Most of the commands we have covered. If any missing, you can set it by yourself here. And next time onwards, whatever command you will set it here. Like let's say you have set this one. Okay. And now you verify something or you do something and then you uh, let's say submit or whatever. Next time when you will click on edit button here, you will see that your command is set over here. Now, 
let's say we want to verify this uh, at find by I showed you see why I showed you suppose you have written this kind of selector see why by by dot x path and all so you see guys one more thing here by default this way it will open you have to click on this selectors healing button this pop-up opens suppose you have click on cancel or submit so how you to get that pop-up again you have to click on this edit button then it will open and here you can paste your script so this time our command is like by dot link text by dot tag name right so let's select that from here by dot select the value select this and submit here you will find the result so of course like those selectors are not here so that is the reason it is showing but whichever is available it is showing the result in fact like let me show you one some real time example from the vnormals labs here selenium page let's say let's say account page and here you can copy this so this is a really complex scenarios so now we copy this and go to that page once they belong those selectors like let's say this is the page yes yeah. and here this is the account page so let us go to account page yeah, this is account page only inspect so click on this button and paste it here now command here is by dot selector value so we will keep the same command by dot selector value and submit and here you got the result so this way you will be able to verify any kind of selectors in fact let's say in this repo if we have playwright selectors as well yes pw pages home page so these are the playwright selectors let's say they're written so i will go here go to home page click on add it and verify paste and this is the command here private string so if you click on here you will get this private string select this submit and you get the result so this way you can verify all the selectors in one go for any page for any kind of script irrespective of whether you are using selenium cypress playwright or any automation framework or any programming language so this is going to be very very helpful i'm sure you will love this and this feature is going to help a lot to uh make all the automation script which were there in the backlog and you all will get a great help from this so request all of you that please like and let others know about this feature and this is right now of course available with the pro version soon we will add it in free version as well and if you we really want everyone to try this so we have added one month free trial for everyone and once you try it this is like almost free for everyone but yeah of course we have to uh, like make all the free products and all these innovation available for each and everyone and we are working on a lot of new tools as well so we need this financial support as well at the same time so that's the reason we have it in right now in pro version but uh, you take a free trial of one month and before one month you can cancel it and then you ask your company to take the uh, team plan so that like there will no burden on your pocket and for company this pricing is nothing it's almost free just uh, 30 dollar imagine 30 dollar a coffee or beer cost for a year so 30 dollar per year it is it's not month per year and in indian currency it is just 1800 per year so this is like it, it can you can consider it as a support for selectors hub and all the tools which are available here uh, on the selectors hub umbrella so do give it a try subscribe to the channel and like this video let me know your thoughts in the comment section please do let me know if any command is missing what you want to add over there and if any improvement in this feature required do let us know this is very first release so definitely there will be a lot of enhancement and a lot of improvements will be coming over there so looking forward for your support and any feature enhancement do let me know in the comment section thank you thank you so much bye, -bye.